Hey everybody, so I was leaving work, leaving to go to work the other day, and this little cutie ran straight up to me like we were old friends and have been old friends for many years. And so we were keeping her. And at first we didn't think we were going to be able to, but then um, we just got done spending $600 on her, and we thought, yeah, we'll keep her. But, uh, Right now we're calling her Annie, but we have another dog. His name is Randy, and we think that it's just a little bit too close um, in in name. But look at her. Just look at her. <laughs> she is she is so sweet and so loving. Um, you can't tell very very well. Well, let me see if I can. Can you turn your head a little bit? Can you turn your head a little bit? You see that little mark right there? Uh, the vet, what it feels like is that there's two BBs in her face. Like somebody had shot her um, at fairly close range with a BB, with a BB gun. And they're not bothering her. She, they don't seem to be bothering her at all. And they're not impeding on anything that she needs to do it's not hindering her at all um it was just a really bad sore but it's healing up nicely they did a really good job um i guess there's two two marks there poor little girl um but she just came home from the from the vet today um she had she has parvo and if you don't know what parvo is, it's um, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a virus. It's part the the parvo virus. Um, what it is is basically it's a really severe form of the flu for dogs, um, and that usually strikes dogs before the age of one or if, if they're ten and older when their immune systems are very very weak, and um, so she just as long as as long as you can. One thing you can try if you can't afford the treatment, because the treatment can be expensive, is uh, keep them hydrated, and for the first for the first 48 hours, just keep them very hydrated because they're going to vomit and have diarrhea very severely, and that's usually what kills them is dehydration and the high fever. So if you can, um, um, so if you can keep them hydrated and keep them keep the keep, keep try to get their fever to come down you can you can you can keep them from dying from it but uh but there's also a medication that the vet can give them that basically works on on the flu it's 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 a human flu vac uh, not vaccination but medication but it works it mir works miracles on dogs with parvo and um that's what we ended up doing she's playing with the cat doesn't like her <laughs> Annie, it's okay. He doesn't want to play. Um, so, <coughs> Mr. Green, come here. I know, I know. He's evil. Just an evil cat. Don't be scared. She's got her. She's got her scared ears on. Um, I know. Just a lot of changes been a busy week for you. I know. It's been a very busy week. Poor little thing. But, um, but yeah, if you can keep them hydrated and keep their fever down, then the chances of them surviving are, are, are very, very good. Um, another thing you can try is to get them bland dog food, and they sell it at any pet store. Um, just a very bland, uh, pet food and um, don't give them a lot all at once you have to give them like a two teaspoon to three teaspoons at a time and just wait an hour and then give them some more and then wait an hour and then give them some more um, so so basically you just want to keep them from having severe diarrhea and severe vomiting and then um, if you can do that you can keep them alive within two weeks they'll survive it but 
we were fortunate enough to have the money to to take her to the vet and the vet was very grateful um that that we decided to keep <laughs> to keep astray and she's she's just a, a really good dog so we have to keep her quarantined from the dogs cats don't get parvo um so that's that's good and uh, that's okay because the dog the cats don't really care for her just yet if she doesn't know what to make of them anyway a little puppy butt but um yeah this is our new addition this is little annie little orphan annie say hi to everybody she's staring at the cat okay talk to you guys later